What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Young Woo, back with some more on the block news, man. Before I even get this shit started, make sure so y'all hit that like, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, man. Not later, but right now. Now, listen, man, I'm, I'm scrolling through my Instagram. I'm constantly seeing... Uh, I'm constantly seeing Blueface and Krishan. I'm constantly seeing Blueface and Krishan get into it. You feel me? Uh... I ain't really pay attention at first, like, cause a lot of the times I scrolled past that shit. But I see that Blueface posted the baby's or a private part, or you know, I guess the baby got a hernia. You know, I don't, I don't find it funny. I don't think that's cool that the man posted the baby's private part because when you going through something with your baby mama, you feel me, your woman, like the baby is innocent, so he he got no business doing that. But I will say this, though. The way Krishan is moving, the way Blueface is moving is out of spite. So Blueface, in, in no way, shape, or form, is he right for posting that baby with, the, with you know, private area. But I will say this, because it's a couple things Blueface said that I agree with. I don't agree with the post about, the you know, with the baby, showing the baby's private part because the baby is innocent. But... What I do agree with, hold on. What I do agree with is a couple of the posts he said. A couple of the posts he said. Hold on, that's not the one. But that fucking post. So let's talk about it. Um All right, so I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna read the post that I don't agree with. And then I'm going to get to the post that I do agree with. I don't agree with Blueface in this post. He said, my son don't got a cock, and she on here popping it. So you know what I'm going to do every time. Checkmate. She is a bad mother. Yes, she is unfit. She been pushing the surgery back, missing an appointment so she can do what she wants. I, w I went to be more thinking this surgery. They talking about she missed the appointment. Um, So I don't agree with with Blueface putting the child's personal business online. But, you know, this baby mama, baby daddy drama type shit. So, you know, he, he exposed her. He, he, he do kind of got a point. You feel me? You is unfit if you spending all this time on the internet bashing the daddy for what he's not doing. You need help. You are. Every time you sit here and have a conversation, you pull out your fucking phone and try to talk about it on YouTube. That's dumb and this childish. This content for my channel. This is blue face no, and Chris No, it's not. You're dumb, childish, and petty. You're dumb, childish, and petty, and you do that every fucking time. You fucking weird as fuck for that. You weird as fuck for that. All right, as you see, I have a disagreement going on in the background, but you 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 are a bad mother and unfit if. The time you could be using to tend to your child, you're neglecting your child to bash your baby's father. That's bad parenting right now. That's unfit mother to motherism. And that's just how I feel. Like, Krishan, Blueface, y'all both need to be off the motherfucking internet. You feel me? Y'all both moving spitefully. Y'all both moving spitefully. But Krishan... You are more connected to the child because you carried the child for nine months. You know what they say, mother's baby, daddy's maybe. The mother got to be there, going to be there. It ain't no guarantee that the daddy going to be there. So you can't just because the daddy's not doing what he's supposed to do, neglect the child and then talk about the dad. I'm just saying. You feel me? I know a lot of people, a lot of critics, they're going to disagree with what I'm saying. But, you know, with me being a YouTuber and all, a blogger, vlogger, whatever you want to call it, I got a podcast and 
and I got a voice on my channel and I choose to use it. Anybody disagree with what I'm saying? They can create their own channels. They can voice their own opinion. Whoever agree with it, disagree with it. You can build a following. You can become a voice. But as far as it comes to my channel, I'm going to voice my opinion. And like I said, I'm not choosing sides. But maybe I kind of relate to the, the dad side to, of it more, the male side of it more. You feel me? I could point out when Blueface is wrong. Yeah, he wrong. Nigga, that's wrong. You wrong for that, Blueface. Why would you post your child's private part? But... Everything Blueface is doing, I believe, is is just adding to the wrong of what Krishan doing. He's responding to it. Like, you went and named that baby Krishan Jr. and gave that baby your, your last name. And Blueface is right. How can I feel a connection with a baby that don't got my name, my last name, nothing? Like, how the fuck do I know it's mine? Because usually mothers name they ch give their child their last name when they don't know who the dad is. I'm just saying. So if a nigga thinking like that. How can you feel connected to the baby when you're not allowing a connection to happen? Like, how do that sound like the mother giving the baby a boy the name as her? That's fucking, that's fucking, that's fucking crazy. That's fucking mind blowing. Like, how are you going to name a boy Krishan Jr.? Like, you the nigga. Like, you the, you, the, you the man in the relationship. Then you want the daddy to be a daddy. But how the fuck can I feel like a father to my first child when you gave this nigga your name and your your daddy's last name like was you fucking your daddy i'm just saying you feel me i understand what Blueface coming from on that but i'm trying to find this post though because it was a couple of posts that i actually agreed with you feel me and, and, and uh got inspired to come come do you know um come on here somebody said Blueface needs to be in jail immediately now, Krishan, you you had that baby outside knowing there's something going on between your son's legs, and you know damn well Blueface don't give a damn about blasting your ass when y'all beefing. Honestly, this better baby is better off with none of y'all. This these are not the posts I'm looking for. She's going online. She got the she up in Walmart with the baby. Everybody know when you have a baby, like you can't just. That's what I'm saying. Like. Maybe I am kind of biased because I, you always hear about what the dad is not doing and what the dad need to do, but nobody blasts the mother. Why the fuck is you in Walmart with a dog in one hand and you got to, it takes two hands to support a fucking newborn baby. You got the baby stressed out with the neck, motherfucker doing the ballerina, you feel me, and not focused on the baby, but you getting on the motherfucking internet bashing another man. Like, do your job as a motherfucking mother. Why the fuck is you even on the internet? You feel me? Now... Listen, I'm just saying, I'm just saying I can relate to this situation. I'm just saying, because I'm a man. And, and you always hear about niggas being deadbeats, niggas not being there for their baby. What about the motherfucker that is there and just ain't doing doing what they supposed to do? I'm trying to find these posts, though. Hold on. I was just looking at these damn posts. Now I can't fucking find them. Oh, man, he said, Blueface said, I had a baby with a crack baby shaking my head. It's my fault, too. For real, can't cap. I tried to get that abortion, but she prayed for this shit. Now, that's how he feel. I can't get mad at how Blueface feel, like, because I always said something was wrong with Krishan mentally. You feel me? And I think they actually said Krishan mama was on drugs. You feel me? So it's a possibility that Krishan could be a crack baby. He's not calling his baby a crack baby. But if Krishan is really a crack baby, that's what really occurred. Blueface had a baby with a crack baby. And you already know when you have when you have babies with someone with mental issues or they got some type of problems in their family, your baby can be affected by it. But again, Blueface is wrong for posting that baby's private part. But I'm still looking for that these other posts. I'm still looking for the other posts. But, uh, shit. Hold on. I think, actually, I, I, I spoke on it, though, about the Krishan Jr. He, that nigga said, like, um, you, you carry a baby for nine months, you got the connection. Like, you're not allowing me to have connection. How can a father feel connected to the baby when the baby don't got your first name, your last name, and then the mother going online, bashing everything you do, like, 
how can you get close to that baby? And then you look at his first baby mama, Jaden. She's not bad. Well, I think she bashed him online saying fuck him, but not about his parenting. See, she probably said fuck him and he doing her wrong, but she never said anything about his parenting. You see how the relationship blue face. Matter of fact, this ain't even blue face first son. This ain't even blue face first son. I'm tripping. You feel me? You already got his first son. His first son looks just like him. He got a connection. He got control in that. Like I can, I can say this because me as a man, like. When you have a child, you want to have some type of control over your your child. But if if you don't have no control over your child, and and, and the mother making the situation making the connection between y'all so difficult, you do want to say fuck the child. You don't want to fuck with the child. Like why am I about to break my neck and stress over a baby? But I don't got no control over the baby. You're not gonna teach the baby because you're already teaching your baby to disrespect the dad. Like you feel me? So. It's just my point of view, man. I'm going to speak on this shit a little more later. I know it's going to be a lot of people out there that disagree with me. I know I know, a lot of niggas going to agree with me because some of the things Blueface is saying, he ain't wrong about saying. He ain't wrong about saying. Like, you outside, you all on the internet. Like, take that baby to the motherfucking hospital. You feel me? That baby is innocent. Like, you on live. You talking shit. You feeling, you feeling this fucking... You brainwashing this child before they even know what brainwashing mean. You filling them up with bad shit about the dad. You feel me? When we in reality, Krishan, we wouldn't know who the fuck you is without Blueface. We wouldn't. We didn't care about no fucking Krishan until she showed up on Blues Girls Club. Blueface had already made it. You were still trying to make it. You probably you would not be where you are if we didn't know. If if it was no Blueface, Krishan, it would be no you. And that's just facts. I mean, you'll still be here on this earth, but the you, you wouldn't have a fan base and motherfuckers wouldn't care about you. You feel me? So I feel like no matter what y'all go through, both of y'all, y'all should still have some respect for each other. You feel me? And respect for the baby. Like, both of y'all kind of neglecting the baby. You feel me? But at the same time, the mother always got the most control over the baby. Like, the, the mothers, they get custody of the kids. They say, fuck the daddies. They they the daddy and the mama and all that. And what do a nigga supposed to do? Do a nigga supposed to cry? Do a nigga supposed to stress over that? Like, bitch, why I'm going to stress over this? You and you taking that baby and you telling me what I ain't going to be able to do with this baby. When I got two kids in the house with me that that's going to listen to what I say, that's going to follow my rules, and that's going to be instilled with the things I instilled in them. You feel me? Because as you see, it's going to be a disconnect between Blueface household and his way of thinking and Krishan family way of thinking. You feel me? So it's already a disconnect there. So like I said, some of the things that Blueface is doing is wrong, but some of the things he's doing, I don't think he's wrong for. I kind of relate to it. You feel me? If you're going to try to take the baby from a nigga and say when a nigga can, what a nigga can do, you're going to go on the internet and bash a nigga about what he is and what he ain't doing. It's going to, nigga ain't going to want to fuck with the baby. Why would I do that? When I can fuck with some, I got these kids at home that love and adore me and the mother is not trying to get in between me and the child. Why would I stress and break my neck for that? I know some of you niggas out there probably like, you do whatever for the kid, but eat to each his own, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Hit that like, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, man. You already know what it is. It's your boy Young Wu on the Block News.